a MBA skills trainer named Phil Beckner. He used to coach uh, on Weber State. He lives here in Phoenix. I've had a chance to be around him a ton. And he was at Weber State when Damian Lillard was at Weber State. And so he uh, lives real close to me. I got a chance to hear him tell the story. And he was talking about when Damian Lillard was preparing for the NBA draft. And one of the things they do at the at NBA um, draft workouts, players will go to different teams and coaches and the GMs and the, all the front office staff want to see these players. And so they just, they, they, they put you in drills that get you so exhausted first. And then they actually start like playing two on two, three on three, doing other stuff, right? So they're doing these long, exhausting shooting drills. And Phil, having been around the NBA, knew that. And so as he was training Damian Lillard, he was training him to one, be in really good shape. Um, and to two, he, he was training him in a way to stand out to the coaches and the front office staff at these workouts. Because there's oftentimes two, three, four, five, six guys at the workouts that are competing against each other. And so the, the phrase that Phil kept using with Damien was trot everywhere, T-R-O-T, trot everywhere. I'll put it in the chat box just so everyone has the spelling, trot everywhere. And it's what Matt had said about moving with pace. He had Damian Lillard do that in all of their workouts. One, just to stay in great shape, right? We're trotting everywhere. We're not going to walk, right? So we get our conditioning up. But the second one is, and we've all been there before. In fact, it's probably been refuted a few times, like don't put your hands on your knees. And then all of a sudden that Google image came out and said, you should put your hands on your knees. You're always communicating something at a tryout. And so one of the things that you're communicating by trotting everywhere, trotting from drill to drill, trotting um, to go get water, trotting to when a coach says, let's go from this uh, area of the court over to that area. You're going to be on defense. Now you're going to be on offense, right? Most people will walk. Just the, the, the comment I made about if everyone's in a white shirt and one person's in an orange shirt, they're going to stand out. If you start to trot everywhere during a tryout, it's another little thing that will help you stand out to a coach. Trot everywhere.